eighty on like seven twenty at best because like I don't know how his Wi Fi's gonna handle one eighty. Stream started. All right, welcome, welcome everybody. This is uh, Overwatch Oasis Season Four, Week Four, Tier Two, and we got today we got two teams: Beast Edition versus the Ramen Noodles. Now, I am I'm Change Six. I'll be your commentator, your play-by-play. Uh, on on casting this is brand new to string team. So let's give it a round of applause quickly. Is Bay One Two One Two One Two. All right, don't worry. Call him Bammy one two one two one two. He loves being called that. Okay, so on both sides here. Um, so Beast Edition's gone for some in some recent changes. Lady of Siren uh, has left the team, and a, a certain fellow named Chain Six never heard of him. He had to leave the team for SR reasons. He um, unfortunately, you know, never don't know, know much about him. But I heard he's quite the top bumper. So, but the side of Ramen Noodles, they got some new pickups. So they 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 have dropped two players. They have dropped Atcat. And they also lost Zanny Boy on main tank, but they got new. They got into some new tricks up their sleeves. So here they got Bleem who's going to start on the main tank here today with Beagle on that Roadhog, mirroring the potentially mirroring the comp of Beast Edition, who was is going to run that Reinhog also. But they also, but they've also picked up a new main tank on their side. Um, the Ramen Noodles has this main tank. This main tank being Young, I think that's how you say Young. So we might see him coming later. Okay. Match starting, and here we go. Both sides coming out. Something interesting, though, is that we, is that the Mercy will be on the side of Ramen Noodles. Nothing, nothing will have to pocket, though. Maybe pocket the Genshin to get him a fast blade, but I don't know. We'll see what happens here. All right, both teams taking stands, and then look at my beast position. They got the they got control point already. Gobbin's missing the hook here. Nah, nah, that's me on cooldown. That's gonna be they gotta take the Ramen Noodles. You gotta take advantage of that here. AJ being aggro without out of position right now. He's gonna get caught with Bill. She takes out Bleem before he can swing the final swing on AJ. And Beast Stitch are just cleaning up here. Focus beam on Beagle, he's down. And one beauty headshot on Gift Sipsies. Frez though, very good rise from Miyuki, but I don't think they can recontest that. Indeed they're not. Ramen Noodles, they're gonna have to disengage here. Never mind! Aggressive charge! That leads to him get charged! Bleem! You have to be careful here, bud. He's getting kept up though. Fantastic support from the side of Ramen Noodles, keeping Bleem up there. But it's not enough! Stealth Raider in the back life blinks in and gets him! Hook on Rav, but that's a May, May Gubbins. You ain't taking a May down. Alright. I buy if I was Ramen Noodles too, I would, I would disengage. They, they're just gonna get feel staggered after staggered if they keep fighting this. Which happens to Stipsy is already down, but that's a great hook on Fleem! And a fat fire strike to a swing on Griffin! And broken like Ramen Noodles, they're gonna pull up here. Oh, I'll cancel on Gubbins! And that's looking like a team fight win, but the shatter! It's massive! And the Immortality's gonna keep all the way up, they're gonna see stole this! But Wizard comes out on the side of Ramen Noodles, and that's gonna catch Self Raider, he's gonna catch Hyperfermia! And this is gonna be like a team fight with Ramen Noodles, Beast Edition! Look at they got the back up here. It... Alright, looking looking here, but they got the re-engage. No shatter on the side of Beast Edition, but the shatter though, is on the side of Ramen Noodles. That's one big ult advantage of both tank golds and potentially a blizz a not blizzard, my bad. A rally uh high noon coming in here. Windows up though. They're looking for some picks and oops, but that's gonna find much here. They're gonna have to rotate out. Never mind the they use the they use immortality fuel instead to keep them up from the high noon. Awesome is going aggressive, but he's by himself, gets walled, he's down! Beagle's in the back right, he's going for his got, got one, he got Griffin, he's going for a support, but he can't just look like he can't get it. But instead, he's gonna find Gubbins. There it is. That's ne looking, looking here, looking here. Ramen noodles. They're in the lead right now, 47 percent. But Sipsy, a bit over aggro, gets gets pelted down by Bill. But the reds there from Miyuki. Once again, that's the one. That's the big benefit. The one big benefit of Mercy is that res. Absolutely a phenomenal ability if you get done correctly here. And Miyuki, so far, is that two successful reses. All right. Pulse bomb on Bleem, but it's not gonna do much. He's being, he's being healed up already. Oh, hog beagle from beagle, and they're gonna catch by a hook. And the in the duplicate from Griffin, almost massive. Beat cancels it. I mean, beat there the cancels that shatter though. And if this is looking like, like a team fight win, if that high nigga get anybody, it dies. Griffin's down. Miyuki, and oh my god, the shatter does get to Miyuki, but she's gonna, she's gonna, she's gonna live. He's gonna live, my bad. 
And Austin should get a bit of staggered here. Never mind, the peel is fantastic, but he's still going back in. Aw awesomely, probably, he should have probably backed up there. And look at Raw Noodles, they've been holding this strong. They've been taking advantage of Beast Citizen, who have been staggering members in one by one here. And look at it's looking like that ramen noodles or will take map one. Snipsy's just sort of solidified that. He's like, yeah, yeah, Griffin, you can take that beagle, but I'm gonna need body shot after body shot here. I'm gonna destroy these fools here. And Wizards there to solidify it, and that's beautifully done from the the, the noodles of the ramen. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, that was they're honestly very poor from Beast Edition. As they they only really had one team, two team fights in that whole uh, whole attack for them. They just kept staggering members in and in, popping ults also. Can, couldn't find the right in, in, in interest because they kept staggering in and in. Something interesting though is also we will be going on that Arisa here. Bookie, 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 look what we got here. A cheese cop looks like with Bastion. Okay. But on the side, on the side of Ramen Noodles, Sims the only swap for them. They're going to be playing the Sim with them still continuing to play the Brigida and Mercy. Brigida is actually a very smart choice. They can easily peel if Gubbins gets a flank on them with that Brigida, with the whip shot or the arm packs. Very smart choice for Ramen Noodles to counter Gubbins here. But they got, I don't know if they're going to be ready for this Sombra, who's in the back line. She's looking for a hack, but instead she, gonna, instead she gets taken down. A big dolk onto the head from Simpsies onto self Raider. And... Ramen Noodles, they're cleaning this bad boy up! Nate is good from AJ, but I don't think it's going to be there with the cap flies on it. And look at, look at Stipsy here! It's an, oh, he has high noon already! He's been, he was feeding off that on Govins there and getting those headshots on Stealth Raider. And he's, he's going he's, he's like he's to take high ground. He knows he has that, he knows he has the old advantage here, and he knows that high noon could potentially get a Griffin or get Govins, maybe someone here. But instead, we Eagles gonna get caught. A nice pull, pull pork from the side of Beast Edition. Griffin though, he's staggered by Ravioli gets them. They're 5-5 five, five now. Rez up, Rez gets Griffin. Govins, he's stunned off his hook. He's gonna have to back up, he's low. And the Eagle Shield is now also low, so this is looking like the advantage of Beast Edition. If they're playing their cards like, if Govins doesn't die here, shields down. And the Eagle deals the shatter, and it's fuck it. Oh, <laughs> It's massive! Alright, Rez up! Bleem is back up, and Bleem, he's ready to pound some heads in! Bleem, ready to come in here! He's and indeed he is! He's swinging away, AJ is down, and Vil, she's gonna go to the Great Escape here! I don't think... Oh, never mind, Beagle knows she's there, Beagle's going down after her! But, she's gone already, Beagle, you have to back up here! Alright, then... Whole hog ready, ready on the side of ramen noodles. But Govins, he's gonna go to the wrecking ball here. I don't know that. I don't really know much about that pick here. They don't. Sure, they don't have a May, but this McCree flashbang and Rodok hook do mighty work to this wrecking ball. High noon's out from Sipsies gets two. That's oh, that's already a reset. The beast she has to do here. Gubbins is just trying to stall here, but like I said, that hook, if, if it hits you, if it hits you, and Beagle gets the hook, it takes Gubbins down. They're still in beast position. They're still pushing this? They're... Stealth Raider's high noon. Doesn't get any sane, and Moki and, and Raw Mutals with a clean 100 0 here. Gonna take Oasis. Gubbins does get the touch, but that whole hog is gonna blast him away. And indeed, Raw Noodles making this, this series 1 0. Yeah, I will have to agree with you, Bambi. They, they not only, not only they kept throwing bodies up point after point without really no coordination there, but they weren't they weren't adapting to the Symmetra. They they and they went and they did some interesting picks also. I get the soldier to try to get back in point in time. That's not a, I don't blame Griffin going the soldier, but the wrecking ball doesn't really make much sense there. Yes, there's have synergy with the wrecking ball and Arisa, but the stuns on the side of of ramen noodles, it's not worth going to ball there. You can't get too much value. Also, I also I gotta say, if even if they do, even if they pick ravioli there, she could just switch to the May. 
making the Wrecking Ball even more of a questionable pick. But Ramen Noodles, they, that looks very clean from them. They, they have, with these new pickups, and they have definitely cleaned up their act from last week, and they're looking very strong so far. Yeah, definitely was. They if they if they just if they just regrouped like they like they did on Oasis a couple on a couple points, they could e they could they could have easily take that point back. But they just threw bodies on point and later and then later on for the Reiki Bomb point, hoping that the stall, but around like 60, 60, 70%, but that's that honestly wasn't the right move there. I actually think a Sigma would have been not not of a bad pick there. The burst damage from the Sigma, if that semi out of position and you just land two primary fires on her, that's sim that Symmetra is basically dead. But, and you go, your shield, the shield also from the Sigma can block that turret damage. They want to, they want to stick, they want to put this, the, the Junkrat God himself kill switch on Hollywood. I mean, Hey, can't blame him. That high ground. If there's no diva on the side of ramen noodles, that high ground is free money for that junk rat. But this is a new ramen noodles we've been seeing, so there's we, we might see a diva come out of them. I, I wouldn't doubt Beagle. He's he's one of our best. He's one of the best off tanks in tier two, and he's going against one. He's going against one of the uh, one of the other best off tanks in tier two, Gubbin slash EAC. Now, oh, let me get the stream up here. I'm going to have to agree with you, man. They did look great last round. Last round. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Yun himself. I have seen... Some early play from this guy, from one of the tier three teams I coached, uh, Diamond Phoenix. I from one of the, they recently scrimmed Ramen Noodles, and I gotta see this guy, this guy in action. He's a let's say a very good Reinhardt. Oh, Bambi, Bambi, it seems like the chat they want you, they want they want you, they apparently can't hear you, Bambi. Apparently they can't hear you. See, have you not been hearing him? Is it, Bambi has been talking a lot, but chat is or is it? Is he get? Is he? Is he? Is he like? Is, can you not hear him at all? Yeah, B Bambi is big quiet. Oh, mm. settings might be off. Maybe there's there's yeah. You might have to mess around with those quickly. All right, all right. Oh, there's yeah. You have straight no. You have straight up no audio, Bambi. Apparently, all right. Hmm. Yeah. Um. If we, we, we um. I was gonna say we could delay the map. It's like probably five, five to four minutes. So you can fix it quickly. But I don't know if the people want that. Do you, do you guys, do you, do you guys mind waiting a bit, or do you want to get the match on the road? Why is that? Oh. You're right, Bambi. Oh, we have a bit of an issue, Bambi. So, though you can't hear him, Bambi, what Bambi has stated, which is true, is Yun has not split his tank on the last two seasons of season. Hmm. Do you mind pointing that out, Bambi? And through. Okay. Okay, what's up? All right, chat. Okay, Yun's back. But how have you been, chat? Have you been good? Have you be. Your sound. Okay. 
score dart train is one zero ramen noodles dart train um so bambi says he's gonna you guys can't hear him i know but he said he's gonna commit to silent casting he doesn't want to he doesn't want to go and fix it i guess so I'm not, I sound, that sounded really cynical. I didn't mean it sounds that cynical. I understand completely. So I will be sole commentating today. Yeah, I get you. I get you. Ooh. All right. <sighs> he is. I spoke to Chiba about it. Hmm. That's a good question. I, what? Oh, look at that. We got some DP boys in here. We got Jail in here, and we got with who's the the one and only Holy Chuckster in Dark Train. We, and we also got Akai here. She's here to I guess Akai's here to support ramen noodles. You know, you gotta support your your teams. I respect that 100. percent Like I said, I love team play, and I love seeing that people respecting that. Oh, uh, what's going on, Dark Train? Um, Bambi's audio is mute, and he said he's and he's decided to go to Silent Castus because he doesn't. I've, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's also because he says Bambi also says he's gonna have to. Bambi's reasoning is that he's gonna have to stop the stream. We don't want. We don't want to do that. If he goes, if he wants to fix it, so we're gonna commit to him Silent Casting. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, Seth. That's uh, some bullix, bro. I got their green. PP's in here. Oh, where's the PP boys? Where's the pizza plan boys? Rap God change. Look, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not Jake. I'm not Uber. I, I can't rap God. All the combos with yourself in chat. Hey, look, I just got it. I got. Look, we, we, we're fa we, we got. We got. We're facing some technical difficulties here. I got to entertain. You know, I, I got. It's the, We call it, it's the, this right now. It's the strategic way of stalling. Oh, Lord Gene, you're from uh Pizza Planet. Oh, welcome, welcome, Lord Gene from the from Pizza Planet. All right, we're good. Okay, we're all right. Getting readies. I left. So who won first point? From grill, first round was won by the ramen noodles. Actually, uh, they took advantage of Beast Edition, who Beast Edition's staggering in, and they took advantage of that. And we were able to hold, full hold, 100 to 0%. What's up? I mean, yeah, but the noodles. If I, if I, if I, if I said beastish, I meant ramen noodles uh, are at one zero right now. All right, Grills here. Cheer on her. Cheer on her uh, past teammate. Rav Yoli, you know, like I said, cheering on his past teammates. Re really cool. Very respectful. Very cool. All right. So have we got ready yet, Bambi? All right. We're ready, okay, ready for beast edition. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm very okay. I I wonder. See, I'm like I said. We're gonna start the match now. I'm wondering if Beagle is gonna have to get on the Diva here potentially. Rodog is not very good on second point here, so we might have to see a swap through the either the Sigma or Diva. Oh, and the words of Ghosty, which is Govin stinks. Let's give a round of applause for Ghosty. Okay, <laughs> calling her own her own boy calling her own boyfriend. Stinks. Hmm. Alright, alright. Here we go, match beginning of Hollywood. As you, as this one of my favorite maps, because how much it changes, you know? Now, I know you can't hear Bambi, but Bambi says he loves Hollywood too. Is that right, Bambi? Alright, he said, he said no. That's unfortunate. Okay. Alright. Beagle, he will stick on the Roadhog here. Young going on that Reinhardt. Like I said, he's a this guy's this guy's gonna be some under underrated talent coming in here. 
on the side of base edition. They will commit to double barrier with kill switch on the junk rat. This is, this is, this is the bread of butter for kill switch. Absolutely a monster on this junk rat here in tier two. So I'm not surprised to see this pick. Griffin's gonna go on the May here. A bit of a late swap, so he's gonna be a bit far back. He, he, I think I believe he won't be able to he will be able to make it in time though, so we all good. But something interesting on the side of beast edition, they're running double flex support of AJ in on the Zenyatta, uh, AJ on the Ana and Phil on the Zenyatta. On the side of ramen noodles, they're gonna be running, they're gonna be carrying around that Mercy. Very respectable, but like, could, this whole comp is built around the Mercy, so it's gonna, it's gonna go, it's gonna go pretty well for them. Big nade on the side of Beast Edition, but like, they're a bit too far away, you can't really capitalize on that there. Alright, walls up, and Gummins is hooked! That's massive, but the, but the peel from Griffin, it's there! He saves Gummins from getting decimated! And now Beast Edition, they're gonna continue backing up. Beagle, he's asleep on his right side, but there's not a lot of much pieces you can do to him. And the teleport is up. They're taking Roman Noodles are taking the high ground here. Here they come. High ground is taking control for them. But but the tank line, they're, they're by himself here. But no one can capitalize it, especially with Stimsy getting a 2k here. Make it, can we make it a third? Can Stimsy make it a third here? Look at like he can't. Looks like Ravi Ravi always stays there to steal that third kill from Stimsy's and. Ramen Noodles, they'll wrap us down. They still should be able to clean this up here. Gummit, he is pushing this Ana, but the, but the human shield from Stipsy has saved him. Tires out, it gets done. This is actually still winnable potentially for the side of Beast Edition. Fox is committed, but boom, Stipsy takes him down. And it's looking like Ramen Noodles will indeed hold this. And unfortunately, the, because the Flux is used and it's canceled. So no value of that Flux. Kill switch is gonna go straight to the Reaper, and uh, it's looking like they want he, he wants to go on this Reaper here to like, potentially take out this Roadhog. Nano's ready. Nano's ready on the side of Raw Noodles. I would assume they're gonna Nano Blade here. The, one of the most bread and butter combos in the history of Overwatch. Ravioli on the far right with that with that pharmacy pocket. Another bread and butter combo that everybody adores this in Overwatch. All right. Here's the blade, coming straight on, Bill is down, and this is looking like an air cleanup for the side of ramen noodles. Oh man, a 3k, a 4k for a snip seed. Alright. This is not this is not looking great for second point here on West the West World part of Hollywood for Beast Edition. Look, look at the order vanish here. Beagle about to get a whole hog. Yun is doing. 5% away to her Earth Shatter, and Rav, she just switched to this far, but almost an 80% of a barrage, that's, she's taking the tricks like it's no one's business, but she's, oh, she gets a bit of a stumble, she might be taking out by kill switch, doesn't, but, it might not matter, Beagle, hook, hook line to secrets AJ, hook line to secrets kill switch also, and he gets the third on Griffin, the headshot at all, Be this, this Beagle, he's on fire today, oh hog, Use to clean this up and beagle with a 4k there. Absolutely clean from the, from the Roadhog on the side of ramen noodles. Snipsy's just he's pretty Snipsy's pretty deep in right now, but he has that mercy to pocket him to keep him up and give him that damage boost to build a fast blade here. Look at this. If in, in, in no, I think you pronounce I might pronounce her name there wrong, you know, I, I pronounce a lot of people's names wrong. But they all know the same the ramen noodles. And fentanyl? Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say fentanyl, it'd probably be called raw, but it's okay. And fentanyl, she only has 30% of the nano, but Stipsy's already, already a blade here. That's how fast this Genji's getting this blade! Here we come. Flux! It doesn't get anything! Uh, Gummins! The rare sight! He beefs it! Fight kill switch! He has a beef that blossom! 4k! Smacking the raw noodles back to spawn! But, though, though that was. A c c good fight for Beast Edition. They did burn a quite a c three ults there. Coalescence burned there. The the Death Blossom got four, so it was good. But the the Flux was also burning, got no value. And now the Nail Blades were ready. There's not enough. There's not enough here to peel potentially for the side of Beast Edition for this Nail Blade. They're gonna have to get this Genji up before he gets the blade. He's in the air. Nails on him, and he's already got Bill. That's Looking like there's no CC on him, and it's looking like Roman Noodles will clean up this up once again. Alright, Beast Edition, they're gonna have to back up here. They can't get staggered. Or... But it's looking like it's going anywhere. He's staying right here. 
He's hacked, and it's looking like regardless, we'll be taking it down. Great hack from Ravioli State. Bill's here to stall, but that's all it is. It's stalling. Shatter hashing his feet because that beam also is going to get a shatter off on the entire team. He's Nano, but he can't get much value on that Nano. I knew for the I knew for the side from Griffin. Get two! Griffin with the hero play! Drops down like Batman and takes down two! Both DPS gone, but but don't worry, Beagle! He's here to remind the beast position he's also a DPS! He takes Griffin down! Going for kill switch, but he cannot just get kill switch! I stand corrected! He waits for the fade, it hits him hits him on the right in the stomach! Gubbins is here to stall, but for how long can he do it? Beagle, he's still looking for aggressive play. I don't think he knows that Bill is behind him, but he doesn't. And he's just gonna rotate out. Beast Nation, they live another day here. Alright. Awesomely, even he's awesomely has built a fast shatter here, almost at 85%. He might get it, but young, fat fire strike, he's building a shatter, he's at hundred percent already! Alright, sh shatters out! It's actually it's on young! Good shatter for the side of Beast Nation! They catch Young with a mine also! Oha committed from Oha committed. And he's being power boosted by the mercy. It's gonna take out kill switch. But I do not think that's gonna be enough for the side. A beast edition. Oh blades out, but he's not the nano goes on the on the Roadhog. I don't think that was intentional. And the blade, it gets nothing! It gets squat and Bill and Bill still gets taken out by Beagle. She trades with it for takes out the Ana. EMP Shatter gets nothing. Oh the same with that boss was like a kill switch. They're st at this point, they're stalling. They're pu but the, that rally, it's gonna be able to keep Beast Nation up. Gummy's still sleeping with a job, but the, like I said, that rally's gonna do mighty fine work. Beagle, he's gonna have to back up here. And indeed he is, with his, him and his mercy going right side here, hopefully not to get caught by the, the mean ball of Gummy's. Alright, alright, Beagle is already at 50%, and also, Miyuki! 50% also of their of their Valk, they just use that bad boy, it's pretty impressive! Oh, Vale almost gets taken out, she's hacked, almost gets taken out, but the body buff from Gubbins from the hook, that, it's absolutely fantastic! Griffin here, aggressively Blizzard, but it's going it's, it's to be capitalized on, awesomely and Griffin pushing into that tank line, Young is down, that's another reset for the side of Ramen Noodles, and now they're at the 60 second mark, they look, they are pushing point one and two so good! They have, they, they're going to want to cap this time if they want, if they don't want to potentially, potentially go up to overtime. Beagle, he's almost through a whole hog. The Nano is almost ready for that Snipsy Blade. Let's hope they don't, but let's hope they do not mess this up this time. It's that Nano Blade, it's making a fine work with. The only boy that hasn't got worse so far is when he didn't get Nanoed. Alright, Gummins, he's engaging. He doesn't have the minefield though, it's just it's just there for disruption. And grab! EMP! But it only gets it only gets two, it seems like. Griffin and awesomely. And unfortunately, Griffin has to stay to stay alive and get Alright, messy fight, messy fight! Fire strike charge! Takes out two! And Beagle, he's pushing, he's pushing AJ, but Gummins is there with the peel to scare the hog away! And beast and shit, they're looking good here! And then they're, they're gonna hold this! Stun is on Beagle, can't do that whole hog, and the rally is out. That boss is like clean it up, and Beast Nation will hold it here. Honestly, he's doing some squats here, he's just... I would do squats with the job though, there's still a nano play in the field, and he's gonna get sliced up. Ascending one, oh my god, look at it, look at it, they might bring it back here. Snipsies, he's staying alive as well as team. Shatter, it gets two, and kill switch might be down for the cow, but the Reaper, he has that fade. And look at that! Ramen Noodles capitalized on that kill on Ossily, who was busy doing SWAT, and then we'll have Brittia back in overtime! Charge comes in, it's just there for stalling though, he's gonna be taken out instantly! Ossily melted to bits, and Vil smacked with a hammer! Beast it, they, they should they should have not been top fooling there! They had they sh the game was not over over nail point on the field. But this poison might change it. It gets six! The ball but no one taking down it seems like no one had target was no target focus on the side of Beast Edition. They needed that to take a target down that blizzard. And Gypsy builds an airplane, goes in, slashes awesomely. Kill switch though, he's on his signature jump grab, gets wrapped, but I don't think it's gonna be enough here, even with immortality field. Snipsy is just doing the dirty work work. 
clean it up and slice his gub into the heart. And ramen noodles, when, when they all seemed lost, take it in overtime. But, that, but at the same time, Beast Edition, this, they could capitalize on this. If they cap this with more than a minute on the clock, they got a chance. They got a chance of taking this. All right, or let's see what see what either side's gonna pick here. Ramen noodles. They they like, like they've been running. This, they've been consider not considering. They've been being consistent. That's the word I'm looking for. Consistent. <laughs> We're consistent with this Genji comp, and it's honestly most great for them. They have got so much value on these nano blades. Like I, like I said, the only time the Genji blade has not got value was when he wasn't nanoed. That's just showing the power of the nano blade. They will be they will be sticking to the same composition, but with a twist. Snipsies will be going back on this McCree that he was on Oasis. The side of Beast Edition, Ryan Hogg with the side of with a side of Moira Griffin. He'll be he'll be sticking to the Sombra. That's all right, all right. Not a bad pick from Griffin. He just cannot be hooked. He can get a fast AP if he charges off Beagle here, but he cannot be hooked and he cannot be caught by Snipsies, who's been pro who's proven to be uh, a deadly McCree. One one may say he has the eye of the tiger. All right, Griffin is looking like he's actually scouting maybe here, looking in, looking around to see what the, he's they got, telling Beast Nation the calm and for the comms what they have. Rev on the sim here. That's the metro. That teleport is gonna allow fast entry back to this point if they lose his first team fight. That's a that's a hook and a half. Vil, someone gets caught by Beagle's hook and and gets taken down by the hog and the hog and the noodles. He's gonna go for Griffin, but he won't find him. Instead, Snipsy gets slapped by a hook. Govitz, he's you can't doubt you can never doubt Govitz. He's also a good hog here. But that CC on him will take him down, and Young will smash him to the ground with his hammer. And Beast Edition will have to reset here. Look at look at this. Rav has a wall already. I don't know if Beast Edition is ready for this. Though Beast Edition has the coalescence, they might be caught off guard with the with both the coalescence on the side of Ramen Noodles and the wall here. They can't. They have. If, Beast, if I was Beast Edition, I would play this slow here. And the DDR, they're gonna take they're gonna rotate right side. They don't wanna play, they don't wanna play to this hawk, but the only problem here is Beagle. He could potentially get a hook here, but he doesn't he doesn't has opt for it. He's way he's saving that hook for later. Instead, Be Beagle gets hooked! And Beagle, he's low! But the whole hog, the jump bait! It is in it pushes Beast Edition in the corner! But he And Bill, now by herself has to back up! But oh, wait a minute! Beagle, your team was with you, buddy, and he gets taken down! High noon. It's big, but not as big as this shatter from Beast Edition. And that because of that shatter, they'll be able to clean up, baby. I'm wrong. Sipsies get takes out Bill, and they'll come to the whole hog. I don't. The rest is on Beagle. I don't. I mean, I think, I think this might be it for Beast Edition. They got the back up here. Beagle finds Hook on Gubbins. Headshot in the head, and is this smoking grim for Beast Edition? Ramen Noodles, they have the though they don't have the spawn advantage, they have the numbers, and they have Beagle being a chat on this hog! Alright, we're almost at a minute here for Beast Edition, this is looking quite grim. That shatter looked like it was, that was game, made it look like it was game, but... Snipsies was there in the back way with the Mercy Pong, able to take, take out the tank line. Aggressive rally, not a bad pick, not a bad choice, especially with that EMP. Though Griffin is taken down, but the target focus a lot better from Beast Edition. They take out Young instantly, and this now this is looking like the, like the cleanup of the Beast Edition's been looking for all game. But Miyuki, that rest is still available. Super jump in the air. Miyuki stayed alive as long as I can from flying back and forth. But this is looking like this will be it, and indeed it is. Beast Edition would finally take the points. Very good hole on the side of ramen noodles. The, the Stips is going to that Genji, but there's no nano blade. I wouldn't, I would, if there's no Ana, I wouldn't commit to this if I was Snipsy, but he's confident enough to commit to this Genji. So, alright, let's get a 
So you have to build a fast blade here and hope hope Ravi always stains get some massive damage for him to get the picks. Hooks up Wait, that's interesting! You in Fentil! Get over aggro! I'm gonna take advantage of that! But it, but even still, Snipsy's in that is in your back line there with slice of Bill in the neck! Clean up! Hoag is used from Gubbins, but but it, it looks like that Hoag is a two bail. All that damage on Young, bro. Still up, and, he's, and he has a whole. Oh, Sorry about that. I was, I, was, I was lagging out there for a minute. You know, you hate to, you hate to see it. And Beagle, being a, being the chat of the match here, a vast would be proud if he was watching this. Takes out three. Griffin, he's gonna be switching to this Echo here. One of his most well-known picks on, on on an Overwatch Oasis. Griffin loves his Echo. All right, the, the old. This shatter is ready for the side of ramen noodles. They can capitalize on this. But that but chill switch, he's coming in! He gets the double kill double kill on his death blossom! Bill is down though, his beagle. Once again, just putting his presence in the fear of the beast edition. Fight's not done yet, but it might be done when Sipsy's getting taken down. Beagle will find the fight too here, but I don't think that's enough. Beagle, good effort, Beagle, but you're gonna be taken down here. All right, they're good. Ramen noodles, though they they still have some good ults here. Right, that's not what you're looking for if you're the type of ramen noodles. Govins with the 20 meter hook gets Rav, and he's still going in. He's 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 mad that this man Beagle's been taking his honor of the best hog in here too. He gets two. Kill switch there to do his duty as a reaper. Pouts the saw shots of Beagle and takes him down. Ramen noodles, they're just gonna reset here. This is still very winnable. Rav on the switch to switch to the May. Not, not, not a bad pick beside Rav. It's gonna, it's gonna allow for to scare off that Reaper like you just you just guys just saw. Alright, Rav here. She can look for a wall. She has to wait till Osmi gets over aggressive and wall him. That's the plan here for the side of Ramen Noodles. Nade is fantastic from build though. And it's, and it's gonna allow them, it's gonna allow Beastation to get aggro here. Here comes the blade! And he though he didn't have a nano, he still fights Griffin! He's over Osmi too, but he cannot find him! But it looks that like, it still looks like the sides of Ramen Noodles. That's gonna be enough, especially with a shatter from the side of Young, it's there to clean up the dirty, the dirty boys, and bring us the back to spawn. All right, beast, beast edition. The whole thing's looking grim here. They have a nano, they have a duplicate, and the shatter being used for Young there, and a pick, pick from Gubbins on the Moira. It's gonna allow the opening, but also he has the shatter advantage. He has no ward to block their shatter now, and with a chill down, that's looking free, free money, and indeed it is. The main is pinned and Rav is down. So close to a blizzard too. What if what the game GG should be able to stay alive there? Oh, as it's up, and it's gonna this is gonna push back. Ramen noodles. Griffin duplicates the main. Not a bad duplicate. You're gonna get some fast blizzards like you wanted you just sold there. Alright, Snip Steve, he almost the blizzard's out, and he almost has a blade! There's the blade! This can be big! And it is! The damage is massive! But Beast Edition are stuck in place! Oh well, wait a minute! I said the blade, but Beagle said no, no change! I'm here with the hog! Now I'm doing the damage here! I'm the big boss! Big Boss Beagle! Only and hard for Robin Noodles today! Definitely get- definitely booking the tank MVP for tonight's match! Griffin! Kind of something ambitious here. Gummin is gonna touch the ball, but a Bastion this late in the match? Hello, Bastion. He's going to that shield, but the walls up. It blocks the Bastion. He's gonna have to rotate now. And kill switch. Kill switch being the hero of time with the with the Death Blossom. He takes out two, and now Beast have the opening to bring it back. And the, the Shatter Block. It's looking like it will be Beast Nation taking this third point. But be, but the the, the defense. 
It looks bad. It's so good. They're slowing it. The road is slowing as long as they can. Soul Shatter has Stipsy, and he gets pelvic slammed by the hamster. But the defense, so good for ramen noodles. It makes it re one minute for both sides. This match so far, many, many probably saw this match not to be close. Many, many probably saw this beast edition. The people that upset taters last week were gonna take this easily, but ramen, they're, they're bringing it to them. Looking good on every angle today. Fantastic game so far for the noodle, for the noodles. One second. Mm. Sorry about that. I had to take a sip of water there quickly. Okay. Beast is on the defense here first. And they're going versus something cheesy. Something silly champ, as some may say. That they got a Bastion comp with the with the Sigma Arisa. That double barrier. You, you may, People think it's dead, but it's still living. Double barrier is going to be a zombie till, till the end of time if played correctly. Ramen noodles. They're sticking to the Ryan Hog. And for good, for good reason, Beagle has looked deadly, devastating, a god on this Roadhog. So I understand completely why you can to the Hog here. Something I will, something that's interesting though is Snipsy will play the, the other Shimada here, Mr. Hanzo. And honestly, for how great Snipsy has been playing all game, I understand completely. Alright. They, they need if Snipsy can find an opening here. This is game for this. This is game for them. He's looking for it on right side, but that double barrier, the bash cop, he's he's cop. Gotta get the back up here. Bro, Beast Edition, though. They might be holding this great. Affir the affirmative pushes up, almost gets caught, but backs up just in time before he gets the rock in the face. Snipsy's pushing up, looking for AJ, and he finds AJ. That's detrimental for the side of Beast Edition. And Beagle is flanking. The rotate is fantastic for Ramen Noodles. They're gonna pick up the Beast Edition, but Kill Switch. Uh, aim is impeccable. He's gonna pull two supports to the ground, saving Beast Edition from doom. He's going after Snipsy's, but can he find him? He has a Mercy Pocket, this is very scary! We- Oh! Battle of the Mercy Pocket, and it's smoking like Black Gravity, always gonna step in there before it's an assist there! More versus Capcut style! But that- Even though Ravio had the assist there, it's not looking enough, that Bash is still up, and he gets two! Yes, the Mercy takes out the Bash, but- Dubbins is still alive, and he is pelting orbs in! Res cancel from Beagle, a clutch play that can potentially save the, his team here! But I don't, but nothing like it. Look, fiends are looking grim. And a, and a flux is up. And slam dunk. Young is down. And Beast Edition, they full hold this. The, now they can either win this or they can potentially get tied here. Robin Beetle's defense look, look as great as it has this, this, uh, 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 from past rounds so far. All right, all right, okay. So with, with Beast Edition, they 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 did some cheesy cheesy wheezy, as some some might call it a match chat. Uh, they just they committed they committed the crime. Now can they finish to get to the attack here? Oh, something interesting. Uh, Zarya said uh, for this brawl call. Zarya, if not though a popular pick for most players, not she is still not the greatest of all tanks. In fact, if, in fact, if I was gonna run a brawl call, I would run the Sigma right instead of the Zarya here. But Dubbins, he's gonna come into that Zarya. They they must have a plan or something. Ramen noodles. I I like this pick from Stipsy. He's gonna go to the Reaper here. I think he's I think they're predicting that Dubbins might go hog. I really like that pick from Stipsy. And the Brigida, once again, be smart as always. The peel potential for that brig is massive. The only problem though from Ramen Noodles comp is the amount of heals are lacking. Mercy, she's meant to pocket a character, and Brig, though the the, 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 the inspire is great. I don't think it's great enough if just prepared with a mercy. This might be grim if if the burst from uh, Beast Edition is mat if they if Beast Edition are able to capitalize on the burst damage they have capable here. Especially with the Symmetra from Griffin. Teleports up! And now teleporting high ground when Ossley drops! I don't think that was intentional for Ossley. He's frozen! Put the anti-day on grab! You got that's gonna force a crow maybe force a freeze early! 
Charge comes in, but the couch is for the break. What a, what a hero saves Young for being pinned. But the Zarya is still up, and that, is, that Griffin is still up. That charge is big, and it's melting fools away. Young gets down. Griffin about to get hooked, but the peel from Gubbins with the personal bubble. Takes the shot, walls up, and now Rav is down. No Blizzard available now. Unless, be, unless Rama can stall this. Kill switch fights too, and this is looking like the cleanup. Most looking like a beast edition. 1-1. One, one. Tires up, and that tire gets nothing. But Snipsies can't find kill switch. And this will be a, a definitely DB. A cleanup for beast edition. Beast edition. 1-1 one, one against the noodle. Robin Noodles. And man, what a match this, this has been so far. If you told me this has been four matches, I would have believed you, because man, that King's Row, that King's Row, so used to King's Row because of the map rotation. That Hollywood was so grand for both sides. Stipsy is just showing his mechanics here on this Genji. Mm, mm, crystal clear. All right. Yeah. Uh, all right. All right. We, we, let's see. We're getting swaps here now. Bambi, you have anything to say to the chat that who cannot hear you? I'll translate for you. Don't worry. Hmm. I I, I think I will. Don't worry, man. I you can trust me. You can trust me, Bambi. I'll translate for you. All right. All right. Bambi is Can you hear Bambi now? Ladies and gentlemen, I think Bambi, apparently you can. Oh, Grill says Bambi, exclamation marks. I think we can hear you, Bambi. Oh, boy. Yo, Jack, can you hear him? Can you hear Bambi? Oh, nope. Oh, well. Well, that's unfortunate. My throat is going to die today. That's unfortunate. Hey, it's okay. We We tried. I was screaming because stream turned off. Well, Grill, he was trying to fix his voice because this man, this man is, I mean, he's, he's eager to get some commentation, some cover commentation over with me, but it's, a, it's unfortunately not going to happen. Uh, this is honestly, like I, like, like I said before, many might not have sold this as a close match, but people are missing out on this match. They're missing out. This is so far I, one of the one of the best tier two games I've seen all season so far. This fair. You have the turn. Well, I, well, that's not going to happen. I, I'm assuming. Well, that's unfor unfortunate. So we found out the fix to fix Bambi's voice is to turn the stream off, and I don't think that's going to happen. Unfortunately, we, the show must keep going. So, I'm. I would uh, believe so. They don't. They all that that beast edition only has six here right now. Yes, you. Do. Uh, yes, you do. Oh my god, D DP over here recruiting people in chat. Look, as your head co as your head coach, I say don't please stop. <laughs> we yeah, do I got another DPS? I have, uh, look, I have his one DPS player. His name his name is Bambi One Two One Two. I'm not sure you've heard about him. Hmm. Take a sip of water. I know, I know you guys hate to hear this, me gulp water down there, but hey, it, it has to happen. All right. 
you're the best DPS, Bambi? Is that, is that what you just said? I'm gonna have to agree. Um, your DPS has been solid, but you know who else DPS has been solid all game? That I haven't really talked much about? Kill Switch. Kill Switch has been very consistent so far on both the Reaper and Junkrat. I have, like I said, he's kind of their secret weapon right now, as they only have six people in right in right now for them. What? Oh, Red Hood Kitty. Because Vil, Vil has to go, it seems like. Red Hood Kitty will be stepping up to the plate, and match will begin right now. Traveling to Hanamura. Hanamura, this is actually a potentially dangerous map for Ramen Noodles. Junk, Junkrat, if you know Junkrat, you know they love 2 CP. So Ramen Noodles, they're going to have to be careful here. Living Truth coming back in here to play the Zen, it seems like. Miyuki, I would assume being sticking to that Mercy. That is their cut, is their bread and butter comfort food, southern food comfort pick. Point. Oh! For, sur for sure. They were just picking characters because you, you have to start the match, you know, and which you have to do. Thank you, Bambi. <laughs> okay. Ramen noodles. They're gonna they're gonna be here on the defensive, if I'm correct. Right? They gotta hold off. They gotta already the whole potentially do a narrow grade defense. Like they're like I said, they're gonna defense of Hollywood on first point on on Beast's first attack. It was pretty pretty good. Let's see if they can recreate that defense on Hanamura, a map that is very very easy to hold. Living Truth is not gonna be playing the Zim. In fact, they will be playing the Brigida with Miyuki getting off the mercy of the go Moira here. First for first time I, for, I've seen that in years. Snipsy though, he's gonna point that Genji once again. I'm not really sure about that. Snipsy is a great Genji, but no Nano Blade. Couldn't mean trouble for if he blades. I don't know though. I I don't know. He could pretend. He might be able to get something out of that blade. And, and, and also, also the fact that he has his has Beagle here on his side, pumping the damage whip alongside with him. All right. Kill switch on the jump run attack. Very interesting. Snipsy, he's gonna be holding up pretty close here. I think he's scouting here, potentially see what the, the species should have. Gubbin stick it to Asaria here, like he was on on the final push on Hollywood. It's very rare to see Gubbin for force off that Roadhog and Sigma, so ladies and gentlemen, this is a sight to behold. But Gubbin's pushing up aggressively, trying to find some damage. But the hook is big, but he gets the rock target. Killswitch has the mobility to escape, and he does. Griffin pounce the arrow to Stimpsy's brain and beats him. This is their opening. Blame is low. They have to kill him, and they do. Killswitch finds them, and now th this. Now, Beast Edition, you take this first point. The hog, hog tries to find Zarya, but the peel is there and he is kept up. Not for a turret though, Ravi always stays his turret does take Gubbins out, but I, be, I, don't, I don't think that's enough for the side of Ramen. Coalesces has to be used here by Red Kitty and Snipsies, you can't, you can't deploy the Kami Gubbins, huh? Uh, teleport still up, I, I don't know if Beast Edition knows the telly here. Ramen noodles are not committed to that teller. They're gonna they're gonna hold second. Teleporting will now be destroyed by Osmoly here. Though I don't think that teller was gonna get much value. Because because how close it was. But it's okay. Hey, whatever. Destroy that telly, destroy that telly. Alright. Ramen noodles, they're holding point here. I got I'm gonna give high ground up for free. That's pretty deadly. Especially with a chunk rat on the, the side of beast edition. Ravioli will take top right with the telly, but those tiny balls, not only they're not going to do a lot of damage, they're not going to do a lot of old charge. Snipsy's coming in the back, right? trapped by Red Hood, lays out, and he fits to the beat! A second too late from AJ! Oh! And Beagle's there for the cleanup, gets two, slaps him with a hook, and sends Beast Edition back to spawn. AJ is still here, he has to jump off the cliff or get out! If you're a Lucille, you don't want to be staggered here! And indeed, he will get out! This is on the run, but... He's not gonna be able to catch up to Lucille, he's one fast boy! Beast Edition, they're gonna be going back top right! And Ramen Noodles, interesting enough, will be playing point here. Actually, Beagle! Saying top left this time! And he finds a pick! But... but 
doesn't get the one shot, unfortunately, and he gets pooped away. He's gonna drop the high ground. Once again, high ground giving up for free. Ravioli is playing Ash here, trying to find a pick. Ash, a great, and ever since those recent buffs, has been a great pick for many teams. But Ravio will find the pick. Stipsy will. Griffin is down, and Beast is shit. They're still committing ults. Here's a grab, but the rally is in the rally. I think it's gonna be able to keep the team up. And Beast Edition, they pop two ults, no value out of them, and they're gonna have to reset once again. Oh, Red Hood, unfortunately, I gotta get staggered here. Red Hood, go was it's almost ready for Miyuki. She, she has to build that hole fast. He has to mirror right over Kitty's Carol Wesson. It's 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 one, it's one of those things that more players must do. But it doesn't. I'm looking like it's looking like she'll ha Miyuki will have some time to build that Carol Wesson up. Griffin pushes up by himself out of his tank and gets hooked by Beagle. And that's the narrative. And because of that stagger, Beast Edition, they're gonna have to they're gonna have to regroup. And another one, a kill switch. Oh my lord, Beagle, you're on fire today. DPS down with- Oh my god! Beagle! Oh my god! He snipes! 20! 20 meters! You don't need 20 meters! How about you have 25 while you're at it? He takes out Red Hood! That's a- that's a- that's Red Hood gone! And that's another stagger! Beast that should have to wait! One thing I find interesting for Stabra- uh, from Ramen Noodles is holding point here. I I would be holding high ground if I was the Reinhardt personally, but it's been working for them so far, so I guess I can't question it. Aggressive Cole West with aggressive pin. But because of that aggressive pin, it leaves the it leaves the sports open for a shatter, and that shatter gets AJ. Gubbins is back on this hog, but cleanup won't be good for the side of beast decision. Kills are just fine too, but the spawn is right there, bud. You're gonna have to back up. Sipsy's on the hunt. He's hunting for a Reaper, and he gets him with those Sherwood kids, teabagging him. Very... Honestly, I would, I would imagine Beagle, Beagle right now is being the chatter for the, uh, the match. But Stipsy's, he's there, he's like, look, he's like, look Beagle, I got you, I'll teabag him for you, Beagle. And he... Hook almost gets Stipsy's, but it misses by a slight. Hook does find Beagle, and he is gonna have to self heal out of there. Go self heal zeros, and here it comes kill switch. Ready to hunt Rav. Griffin also on the chase, but he can't he can't find him. Hook's on Rav though, and Gummins got the Gummins is the one that finds him. Shatter blocked, but the pit the counter pit kills Living Truth. Aggressive beat. This is the amount of ult being pumped through beat station. This is gonna be this is gonna be it. They're gonna have to clean up here and now. Yuki's on point to stall, but not for long. OS is also being popped, and that's gonna melt the people on point. Rav getting Kami Hobby Hard away. This this Moira is an ultra instinct right now. Rav hitting fighting two. Shatter is cancelled! Gummits! He's being clutched today! And the perfect Sipsies! Oh my lord! And because the book it's not done yet, the nade allows the deflect on kill switch. No self heal for you, and he takes him down. This is still winnable. And because of and because of that rally, it's more winnable for the side of ramen noodles. Oh no! Beagle fights Red Hood, fights Guppets, and though that pin takes Beagle off the fight, it also picks Awesome off the point. And awesomely, he's gonna get pelted by the, the shotgun from. Beagle. They're, they're, look at Beast, they're just, they were so close to capping, but Ramen Noodles with the with, with that clutch nade from Miyuki. Hold it! And they go, oh! They don't touch. Kill Switch was right there. I don't think he was even boobs. I think he, I think he was able to rafe before he got booped, but... Oh no, that's Charlie Niner. If I haven't seen one, if I ever seen one, oh no. All right, Beast Edition. That they they did get a lot of progress on that second point, but this is gonna be a rough one. Especially against especially against the the the, the, the Chad presence of Beagle and Snipsy. Ready for battle.
All right. Double shield committed once again awesomely. He's very comfortable on this Arisa. Griffin will also be putting the Symmetra here with the Junkrat. That's a lot of spam damage. That's going to be coming, coming way of the side of Ramen Noodles. But Noodles, they have one thing. They have one one key thing that can end the entire composition of Beast Edition. And that's Farah. Ravioli is going to be on this Farah. And Snipsy is being on the Echo. Uh, I... The Echo, I haven't seen Snipsy play that much of Echo, but I believe he should be good at it because, you know, he's a he, Snipsy's proven to be a fearsome projectile player. So, I'll give, I'll, we'll give, I'll, 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 I'll go on a limb and say Snipsy is a great Faro. I mean, great, great Echo. Alright, Beam coming in aggressively, and like I pointed out, that rap, Ravioli on that Faro opens a lot of things up and it gets AJ instantly. Snipsy, he has that focus beam because Kill out of position. He used that beam on him to take him down. And b should I don't... That might have been a bit of a misplay holding that aggressive with a double barrier. If you're running double barrier, you... You should hold point? Or even around a corner. Not, not hold choke like that. And that's... And that will be a clean cleanup for ramen noodles. AJ, he's stalling it, but... Not for long. And because... Good news, though. Because of the recent respawns, AJ will be back with his team in time, so let's... It's just a story for a couple percent, they didn't harm them that much. But what will harm them is the old percentage. Look at the Lucios here, living troop at 70% of a beat, while AJ is 25. They can literally just aggressively beat and take points. And that's and their speed, and look, look at that! Their speed boost is straight from main! Hook though, blocked by double the barrier. Oh, it pulls Dipsy off the ground, but he's playing Echo! He can fly right back up in time! But the, the but that spam it goes into effect. B Bleem is down. Rise up though, presses up, and Bleem is back up. But the but Kitty, Red Hood Kitty, is there and takes out Snipsy. And because of the cleanup for Red Hood, even with, the, with that res, this is looking grim for the side of Ramen Noodles. Flux being committed here, maybe a bit of overcommitment. Oh, oh my God, the Flux is massive from Gubbins, but. I don't know if it was necessary. A coalescence that could have been saved also. Beast edition, they're old tracking, looking a bit scuffed right now compared to compared to past games. One good thing though is that the beat is ready for AJ, and he's going to have the beat ready for Living Truth's beat, and the Bongo is also ready. And oh, Griffin with the aggressive flank takes out Stipsy before I can finish my sentence. Okay, that's gonna that's gonna be of a stagger. I don't think Rez is ready for Miyuki. But Griffin should have I don't know why he pushed up there. Very over very over aggressive from the side of Beast Edition. Sombra's out. He's just, just gonna look for a hack maybe on that Risa, but the Risa's already down, Ravioli. You can't hack that dead Arisa. Beats out! Here's the aggressive beat I was talking about. AJ will counter beat, but his tank is already down! It's only Gubbins on the field right now, and he's hacked! But well, this rip tower could be game changing. Gets nothing, but the high noon will pelt Rav in the skull. It will be enough. Duplicate high noon gets nothing though. And kill switch will aggressively push Snippy, and he finds the duplicate and takes him down. He'll be he will be bombed to oblivion, but no duplicate means no fast high noons anymore. Beast Nitch can easily easily stall this now. Griffin's on the soldier, but how for how long? Not long. Snipsy's there with the answer with the focus beam. The f Shatter misses the flux because of the fact the flux is not cancelled. All that damage on Bleed, he's living on a he's moving on a prayer right now, and that prayer will not be answered. Miyuki, he go for this res though, and the way that res will be got, B will push Dossum into the wall with that whole hog, and he, he takes him down. Griffin's here with the stall, but he needs to find a pick on this doom fist. The only troop goes another beat up on this team fight and pops it instantly, keeping the team up and rap and Beagle finds Griffin and this is looking like a team fight that's looking positive for the side of ramen noodles. Copy of the Reaper, EMP, here comes the Blossom! Oh he's building the upset. Well, give him a minute, there it is, Blossom out. And against Griffin, and against AJ, and it's gonna get Gubbins soon, and Gubbins Pilot's pop! Almost pile drives to the immortality, but clips it. The peel also he pins Bleem, but it's not enough. The peel is there from Beagle and he hooks him out with the pin. And this is looking grim for the side of Beast Edition. Hacks, ha 
attack is good for me. I have Griffin has no abilities. There's no one shot potential. Gubbins is just, he's just, right now he is just playing for a minefield. He wants to stall this. Oh. Kill switch tries to get a blossom out, but the focus beam is very mighty. It melts him instantly. Th these focus beams have been a bit on point, perfectly timed from Sipsy. Shatters out from all crashed out from Bleed, but it gets nothing. It's blocked him awesomely. Here comes the seismic slam, but he gets hooked right out of it. And he's taken down by Beagle, who once again is pretty his Chad presence. Though the beat is out from AJ. But Gubbins, because of these hacks, has not built a has not built a minefield now. He's been on this ball for almost two minutes, and this minefield is only a 60%. Beagle was there to do the cleanup duty, and Snips is the duplicate ride! Shatter ready! Sweet away! Looking for looking for, I would I would soul shatter this if I was him. And indeed he will! Soul shatter on Gubbins and all that CC on the ball. I don't think anybody else can touch it. This is looking game and it is. 2-0, 2-1 for Ramen Noodles against Beast Edition. Snipsies showing that their Echo is just as good as their Genji. Their duplicates were, were excellent this match so far. Look at, oh, the unfor almost hit that pot, the immortality, but got shot the last second by Snipsies and 50 eliminations from the from the boy with the ramen bowl. Absolutely oppressive for the side of the for the side of ramen noodles DPS. Can't forget Beagle though. 69. Nice. Hope that hook I can see. Mm. Mm-hmm, indeed, man, we are heading into the last map here. Potentially last map, actually, I should say, because this could... Route 6, not for C6, my bad. See, I still have last week's map pool in my head. I am throwing, guys. You can call me out for that. We're, we're heading in on Payload next map. Indeed, it will be Watchpoint Gibraltar, and... I, DP, I DP. I'm having, I'm having Diamond Phoenix on my head, apparently. B-E. B-E-D-P. Hmm. Sounds similar, you know, that sounds... Has he? Oh! Maybe he had a bit of a Wi-Fi problem. Put that... Hmm. So, sorry, Chuck. I didn't mean to debate you with the DP comment. There, DP's no... DP's only in chat, Chuck. All right. All right. Uh, we might see. Oh, Stealth Raider in. We might see a far battle between him and Rav if Rav commits to this far again. What is what is payload? Well, at Cap, I'm glad you asked. Payload is a map type in in this in Overwatch 2016, a Blizzard Entertainment game that also has Activision back in it. Payload is a map where you have to push a, a certain objective, a moving objective. It could be a spaceship, a car, it could even be a bomb, for, you know, as, or even an EMP, like you know, it's on King's Row. And you have to push that bad boy all the way to the, to the end. The, there's two sides, attack and a defense. Attack pushes it, defense tries to stop the attackers from pushing it. All right, and with like because there's no other swap sub outs on the side of Beast Initiated, I will I I, I expect this is the this is what they're keeping ramen noodles, looking strong as strong, very strong ever since the new pickup of Young. What's what's up, baby? No swaps. Okay, they're sticking to it. I don't blame them. This is looking so far as much of the strongest lineup. All right, so ramen noodles. I'm. I I will go. I will go on a limb. I might be wrong, and I might be called out. I'm gonna go on a risk in, on a limb and say that the biggest change so far for them has been court teamwork coordination. It's most fantastic from the from the, the noodles so far and compared to the, the last week's game 
where like they were they were rot- like for example they were rotate away from the main tank constantly and stuff like that. They have looked perfect in rotations. I am very impressed for the, how quick of a cleanup Ramen Noodles had from last week to this week. Very impressed by 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 Ramen Noodles. All right. Map four, both readies. Let's head, let's head it. Arriving at watch point, never heard of, you never heard of payload? Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I tried my best to explain it. The Diva Main 337. I'm assuming you're... Uh, I, I might be wrong, but CM Punk, right? Is that you, Diva Main? I might be wrong about that. But I'm going to go to Limit and call you CM Punk. I might be wrong about that. <laughs> um... This is Punk. I got it! Oh, hey! I got it. Look at that. Big Brain Change 6. The 5 head play predicting who it was. Okay. Okay. So, Beast Edition. They, a lot of their strats have not looked clean for them so far. Are you sure it's Punk so far? First of all, why not? Wait. What did you call him? What did, what did you call the mod, Lindsay? First of all, it's gonna fall. I'm pretty sure it's Punk because he said it was him. I don't know, man, man, shape, man. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm assuming that would be Jibba? Are we going to limp? Yeah. Cause she is stream team. Well, I'm stream team too, Chuck! <laughs> okay, um, so... So is Bambi. Yeah, Bambi's, Bambi's spoke up too, man. Ba Bambi oppression, shake my head. Okay. Decent Mr. Beast Edition will be holding bottom here. They won't be holding high ground. And Griffin's by himself. He's only gets hacked. But he does get hacked. And he's by himself now. And they then clean him up. Oh, Gubbin spends by Bleem though. But the rest is there. But I don't know if that rest could be enough. Honestly, Pierce, the fire strike pierces for Beagle. And one of the biggest damage tools inside of Robin Noodles is down. Our Okay, self Raider on this Torbjorn. I want to move my note into this, but self Raider loves his Torbjorn. And this Torb might do wonders against this Genji tank. That turret gonna pressure him back like it just did right there. And awesomely, because of their rep, because the, the entire team had to back up with Snipsies, they finally be true. Coalesce is out early, and now, if I was Ramen, I would be running for the hills. And now, I, I, but you can't, especially with a, with a fat shatter from awesomely. That cleanup is there. Blades out. And it's because Bleem got awesomely. This is now Loki turnable, and indeed it is. Whipshot knocks the score of AJ, and Snipsy fights too with what Media is doing with the Hog. Point still being pushed here. That turret though, giving a five percent of all charge of Stealth Raider. He's almost ready for the Mick Mickey D's juice. All right, here comes awesomely. He. You have to be careful. Shatter's ready. He gets the soul shot on the Moira. That's enough, though. I have to... And because of the, with that EMP, that might be a clean up here. But wait a minute. Even though the EMP was out, it was like the EMP does not cancel the overload on the Torbjorn. And Stealth Raider charges into battle. But Steps is still alive. And the ult is canceled. <gasps> oh no. Beast Edition. That's that's unfortunate. They're gonna they're gonna have to get that one up and back up here. Stealthier sticking to the tour maybe? He's, he's sitting in spawn right now. No, he will be going to the Doomfist. Not sure how to go to the Doomfist pick it's a Sombra and a Roadhog. If, they, if, he, if he gets hacked once, it might be the end for him. For example, what happened to Griffin there? Getting hacked and getting focus fired instantly. Aggressive trans out from AJ. This is Beast this is chance to shine. And with a shadow that big, it Smoking like this, it will be a massive cleanup for Beast Edition. Tower Pit, charge on awesomely, but AJ is there to sneak him back in the head and send him back to spawn.
Gumbets gets hooked. This could be a staggering Gumbets. The self fuel zone is just time though. The heck? Grab you can get the heck? And she's got the back of a slim of health left. Whole hog's ready. And, and both support holes ready beside of ramen noodles. Good, good stun from Beagle and Living Truth. They will cancel Griffin's ult. And because there's only one pick, that's, that's one that's one body back up. Awesome, he's getting a lot of pressure here. He can't for safe that long. And he is down for the count. Go ahead, took down position. He will not, he will not find Believe Eagle and will be taken down. Selfier does find someone in the back line. It's wrapped. That's an EMP gone, potentially. They, Beastish can throw bodies on point now. There's no EMP to worry about for now. But they just have to get a big play. And that's, that's their opening. Keys opens the door, but. Beagle, he's a door stopper, and he's there to stop that door from opening and shut it right back closed. Oh this is book. Self Raider can't touch, but I don't think he will. I thought he's gonna back up here, and indeed he will. Self is self is going back to his team for also he touches though, but he's not gonna lose that's just old charge given to the side of Ramen Noodles. Ramen Noodles with four minutes on the clock. Beagle finds a narrow two. He's been on, like I have been stating, on fire today. This hog has been. But you know what else has been on fire? Stealth Raider. Per literally on the torpedo was on fire. And, and gets Snipsy. Takes him down. He's looking for the Sovereign now, but he locates away. He's going straight for that Mercy. Almost fights Miyuki, but has to, has, to, has to use his ult to get out in time. He goes to a small room of a Roadhog that never means good things, and it doesn't. He is taken away Beagle. EMP there. The wild the point to get the value it needs, and it just, it just will clean up a three K okay, with that blade. Valk, Valk though, didn't get a lot of much. Didn't get a lot of value there. Could have, could have been strong, potentially saved on the side of ramen noodles. So beast, they have an old thing. A cap gone now. They get capitalized on. And with no EMP on the on the field. This is book, this could look good, but Gumbets, he kills himself! And... Stealthbringer is just cryo-freezed on this point. He's trying to stall for as long as he can. For how long? Not long enough. And Stealth is down. Ramen Noodles with a very respectful 2 minutes and 33 seconds. Score. Beast Edition, I they they're shaking the they might be shaking the boots right now. Though they lost a lot of players this, this coming week, I I pers me personally did not expect to expect them affect them this hard. Rob and Robin Noodles, good good old Robin Noodles, to capitalize on on the disadvantage Beast Edition's in right now of only having eight players on their team, capitalizing on this disadvantage and and take, potentially taking this game three one. Very, very, very good on the side of Robin Noodles. Attackers incoming in 30 seconds. They're going to be sticking to Miyuki on the Mercy, sticking right to it, and Snipsies will be sticking right to that Genji. Rav will be on the Ash. She couldn't find much value on the Ash on Hanamura, but... See if she can find some find some uh, watch point here. Oh, a new map, new person. Alright. Beast edition. They're gonna stick it to the Zarya Brawl Comp. It's but I don't when you see a Brawl Comp, you don't expect a Widowmaker, and Ravioli is caught straight off guard of her pants down by Stealth Raider. She knocks her head right off. And now, that's, that's gonna be a disengage. They're gonna have to get free space up to beat Sedition because of that pick. That's a lot of damage gone! Griffin tries to get a flank, but Beagle, he scouts him! Good scouting on the side of Bomb Mules. Takes Griffin right out. Rab goes to so Sombra and takes out Stealth. And this is looking like a cleanup 
for Beast Edition. They will fight Bleem here, but I don't I don't think that will be enough to turn this back. Especially with Beagle just being a force to be reckoned with. Res Res is one good thing about Beast Edition though, for the, their, their case, is the res is used on Bleem, so there will be no res on the side of Ramen Noodles in the next team fight. Ult advantage milking pretty pretty good for awesomely. Oh, that's really it. Blade's about to be up. Hog and Falc about to be up. And, 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 and it, heck, with how fast Brig gets ult charge, Brig might have a might have a rally soon. Griffin coming in up the flank, but he's just hooked instantly. And he's down. The hack on awesomely. It's good actually. It's very good. This allows to come coming for free. He's some free slashes on that right now. There's no bear to block all that damage coming in. Oh, that blade. It gets nothing. The peel on Awesome to keep his keep his butt alive is great. EMP is not ready yet. That that can that because of that that will that cannot be cancelled. But the shadow can cancel that. Beats up though. No EMP to cancel the beat. This is looking good for the side of Beast Edition, especially with especially with a Falk being cancelled by Gummit, who has charged up, coming right into the the side of Romulus and smack him off a uh, fistful of energy. Because of all this charge, Gubbins, he went from like 40% to a uh, grab. And he's gonna aggressively grab, keep them respawn. Awesome swinging right into it. And he gets a 3k! Awesomely showing why the Reinhardt works so well with Zarya. A hammer is a hammer, and the grab is a nail. Beagle, though, has the whole off. And this can be comboed beautifully with the EMP. Rash just needs to catch more than one with his EMP to get with the whole I'll get the value. And it's moving like she can EMP this the tank line with AJ pretty very aggressive. And with Griffin down, you don't you don't need an EMP actually. You can save the EMP for later. But she's Oh, but you will commit it anyways, and only it gets, it gets the entire team, but the rally and the EMP might have been a bit overcommitted, but you could have saved that, especially with two down like that. AJ might be staggered here, and he did well. Beagle finds finds AJ. Griffin's prayer bu builds up that death blossom. He has it ready now. And Gubbins, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to take, take your turn your attention to Gubbins' old chart real quick. He has built a graph under almost under 60 seconds. It's been like a minute 10, but that's a really fast graph on the side of Beast Edition. But with Griffin down, that's why your ultimate's gone. And with Blade on the side of Beast Edition, I don't think you should commit ultimate. Oh, sweet. He goes for a shatter anyways, and I don't know how I feel about that. Stealth does find a really true from that shatter, but it's gonna be rest anyways. Yeah, here comes Miyuki. Good, good, good job finding the cover there, Miyuki. Gets the res. And Stealth, because of that cover, Stealth Reader cannot pick him. I don't, like I said, though they have a, sh they have a grab ready, I do not agree with that shatter from Awesomely. Griffin is down again, Beagle! My goodness, Beagle! You got with the man play Overwatch, Beagle. My goodness, you're it's you're it's you're insane. Shatter is massive. Believe takes down the support line and sweeps AJ to oblivion. Bob is committed here with a coalescence, but I don't think that's gonna be enough. Gubbins does find Stipsy, but he's playing Zarya and with a full charge Zarya. Of course, he will find Stipsy. But the res, he get Miyuki gets a narrow res. How is that possible? How to be position? They're Compared to the past souls, they're playing Tibbet today! Alright, Gubbin still has his grab, but and they have a blossom. Griffin just cannot be picked, and he will not. Beagle is not paying attention to the, the, the Reaper, and because of that, he'll get a 2k blossom. Uh, quite funny to think about, when Beagle is not paying attention to you, you are allowed to play Overwatch. If he's paying attention to you, you are not allowed to play Overwatch. You do not pass go. All right, Larry. I like this. I like some ravioli. She gets moved away, but I like this angle. She has. She can build EAP from this high ground now. What the sh shadow's good, but Eagle has the flame. My, my bad has the pin on him, and that's not gonna let that, that shadow get any value. Beast should hold this, and now with Bleem has a shatter. Beagle has a whole hog, and every never mind. Besides the Troop, five ults up for the side of uh, Robin Noodles. 
beat Sinchio and Bookie in a dire situation. AJ, he has to hide on this Lucio. He cannot be caught by his EMP or it's all the whole boss. Speaking of interesting pick though from Gubman, he's going on the Wrecking Ball? I don't really agree with that once again. I do understand Griffin on the, the, the Junkrat, trying to get some spam damage to try to scare the team back, but this EMP on the well, and the or the hacks on the ball will make him have no, get no value here. Here comes the blade, and looking for a pick. He's gonna... He's gonna fight too, but most of that damage being pumped in by Beagle! Red, AJ, AJ gets the touch, but what cost? He's hacked and he's down. And ladies and gentlemen, this is looking like a game. AMP is still up, and because of that, the combo with the shatter is there. Little Troop is taken down, but I don't think you, I don't think you need to commit that B. In a way, that this this is looking done for beast edition. And indeed, after a hook from Beagle, it is ramen noodles will three one beast edition. They like upset that no decision was down, like I said, it's still upset that no one's so coming. And Robin Noodle has played that cleanly. Fantastic game. And fantastic win from from the noodles in Japan. This is this this is awesome his bad shatter that sh that he built up in two seconds here. By Shatter, I mean the fat grab to the Swede. <laughs> Alright. 54 look at Beagle, man. If you're if you already can't tell, that's your tank MVP for tonight. Beagle with God damn man, you salute, Beagle. Salute. You did great. I also I I I did Snipsy I honestly want to give DPS to the side of 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 uh, ramen noodles personally, so I don't know. Like Snipsies, like Beagle and Snipsies were raid bosses today. They were just pounding heads in. Beagle for tank MVP? Yes, Dark Train. I'm gonna to have to agree on that. Uh, Snipsies. I would say I, I want to say Snipsies for DPS. I think I think his he got so much value on this schedule today. It's I think he deserves it because Genji, you know, being a bad, being honest here, Genji being a bad character, you don't see that value being get attained from him usually. But Snipsy's been able to pull that out. Okay, so I, I, I for support, I, I'm feeling a red or kitty for support. I think she has some good coalescence, coalescence that kept the team up, and she, and I, I also think believe like though they she, both maps she was in, she lost. Uh, I think she did great on the Moira. Like I said, coalescence will always. Well time, except that one on one on Hanamura, with, which you combined it with the flex. But hey, ha, you get you get one battle once in a while. I mean, he, I mean, Snipsy's had one battle, for example, but he was still more like Chad. So I'm I'm, I'm gonna say Snipsy DPS Beagle tank Beagle just dominating on the Roadhog tonight. Just looking unreal how good he was tonight, and ready on support. Stealth was uh stealth was not in the it was not in Hollywood, um, at Cat it was Kill Switch and Griffin. Hmm. Yeah, big. Um. Mm. Uh, yes. That's all right. That was tonight's match. One, a crazy upset for tier two. Ramen noodles. They spring back from their. They spring back and they're now two one from their from their from their defeat last league. Beast edition now also two one. They got some adjust, adjustments to make if they're going to want to continue their, the dominant run they started. All right.